second coming of the Lord Jesus Christ is upon us, we still have time to live by the powerful right hand of God, to purge our lives of sin and be pure forever after. Let us pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. We ask and beseech of you to forgive us and have mercy on our sinful souls. Cast down your mighty right hand, O Lord, and purge us from the evil within our hearts, so that we may once again rejoin you in your holy kingdom. Do it forever after. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Today's lesson is the Last Supper of the Lord. When the supper began, he gave his disciples thanks and praise. Then he took the bread. He broke the bread and gave it to his disciples. And he said, take this, all of you in it, for this is my body. When the supper was ended, he took the cup. And again he gave you thanks and praise and said, take this, all of you and drink from it. This is a cup of my blood, the blood of the new and everlasting covenant and a ministry of faith. When the Lord Jesus Christ was crucified upon his holy cross, when his blood dropped from his wounds, it washed away our sins. By the blood of Christ, we will be purified. So that me, so that we may once again, when time comes, join our Holy Father and His Son and thy holy kingdom in the heavens above. Let us pray. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be dealt. Let me cry, come unto thee. Give us this day our daily bread. Lead us not unto temptation, but deliver us from the evil. O Holy Father, we ask and beseech of you that you forgive us of all our past, present, and future sins, so that we may once again rejoin you in the holy glory that is heaven. So that we may not be cast out of heaven by Saint Michael like Lucifer wants us. We ask this in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Amen.